My name is Morgan and I work at Worthington Libraries. Summertime is right around the corner and we know you have a ton of fun stuff planned. Vacations, video games, sleeping. But don't forget about the library. We have a ton of great stuff planned for you too. When you're out of school, come and sign up for our summer reading program, like the day you're out of school. You can sign up online or you can come into the library on May 31st. For every 20 minutes that you read, you get closer to earning prizes. When you sign up, you get an awesome temporary tattoo, and other prizes include a color crazed bookmark that you can color in and use in your favorite books, a rainbow writer pencil that has all the colors of the rainbow inside, a cool patch for your clothes or your backpack, pretty awesome, and there's going to be coupons for free food, and not just any free food, stuff like pizza and ice cream, mmm, vanilla my favorite. And at the end of the summer, six lucky kids are going to win a bicycle. <laughs> That's a lot of prizes. The more you read, the more chances you have to win. We're also doing something a little new and a little different this year. Instead of saving all of our prizes for the end of the summer, we're going to be doing a weekly raffle prize. That means that every week there's going to be a new challenge posted for you. And every week you have a chance to complete that challenge and enter the raffle drawing for a prize. Pretty awesome. That's so many prizes, you guys. You do not want to miss out. So the summer reading program theme this year is Camp Read Some More. And we're bringing back our friends from last year, Asparagus, Winston, and Ricky. Hey, guys. They are so excited to make new friends. And boy, are there going to be a lot of new friends at the library this summer. First of all, we're doing the monarch butterflies again. You guys remember these little monarch butterflies, right? Little pretty orange guys start off as chrysalises and then they bloom into these pretty little bugs. Also, we're gonna have wolves. Real wolves, you guys, at the Old Worthington Library and the Northwest Library. But maybe you like your animals a little more cuddly. How about some farm animals at Northwest Library? That means stuff like ducks or sheep or bunnies or even a chicken. But you know what? Maybe you like your animals a little more arctic. What about penguins? We've got penguins coming to the library in August. Hmm, what if animals are not your thing? How about music instead? We're gonna have a family drum circle at Worthington Park Library in June, and we're gonna have campfire songs and stories. Nothing better than telling stories around a campfire, right? We also have science programs from Ohio State University. We've got drawing programs. We've got a juggler. There is seriously something for everybody. It's going to be awesome. But maybe you're a little tired. Maybe you just want to kick back and read. That's cool, too. There are so many great new books coming out this summer, you're not going to have a hard time finding something good to take home. If you're a fan of Dork Diaries, the author has a new series coming out called The Adventures of Max Crumbly. This is going to be a must read for anybody who likes Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Big Nate, Popularity Papers. It's going to be awesome. If you like your summer stories a little creepier, you've got to check out Avi's new book, School of the Dead. Or if you are a fan of this year's, last year's Upside Down Magic, then you've got to check out Sticks and Stones, the follow-up sequel. Maybe you heard of a little movie called Star Wars? Anybody? You've got to check out the newest installment of Jedi Academy. A whole new group of kids and a lot more adventures. But maybe you want to read about something that's true and you need some facts and some information. Then I highly recommend National Geographic's Diving with Sharks. Hmm, sharks. There's an idea for a library program. If you guys like the hilarious author behind the book Wedgie Man, then you've got to check out his newest book, Don't Call Me a Monster. Or, you guys might be into some of our Who Is and Who Was biographies, otherwise known as the Big Head biographies. There's going to be a lot of these coming out this summer too, so you've got to come to the library and check them all out. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at the time. I've got to go. I have so much reading to do, and I kind of want a snack. Hmm, a s'more sounds good. Mmm, cranky. See you at the library.